there was some news that was got posted yesterday after I made a goddamn video about the novel. So let's read together. Hi guys, I wanted to answer some questions here about the novel so that the forums don't get flooded with questions about it, though they still are getting flooded by questions, so it doesn't matter. This is not something recent. I've been working alongside a professional writer. Aha! I knew it! That was the only explanation how he managed to get everything done at the same time. He did have someone else with him. Question. Who's a professional writer? What are their previous works like? Are they actually decent? Hopefully they are. For the last ten months crafting this story. Okay. Ten months. So during the other games. Okay. Okay. And I'm very sorry about the finished product. So you're telling us it's finished. It expands the mythos. Wait. The mythos? It expands it? It expands the mystery more? That's what mythos means, doesn't it? It means it expands it more. Okay, fine. And reveals a human element never before seen in the games. Obviously, because we've just been sitting in a chair. Though the fourth one is a different story, we're a little kid, getting tormented by gigantic animatronic creatures. There wasn't really much of a human element, more of a let's not die element. The book will be available um, for Amazon Kindle first. Oh yes, I can get it then. But that doesn't mean you need a Kindle. You can use the Kindle app, which works for the iPhones and Androids, if you didn't know that. And even your computers. It will also be in stores in hardback for 2016. Okay, so everybody that has a Kindle, you get it first. Everybody else that doesn't have any of these things like this, you're going to have to wait till 2016 for a hardback book. Meaning, we do have to pay for this. This raises a question though. If this is a novel, it should have over 250 pages. That is the minimum amount for a novel. And I want to know who the professional writer is. Also, I've got a funny feeling Scott did the cover. He just, you know, added Freddy and everything. But human elements, so what are we looking at here? The human side, like before what all happened, we finally get the children's genders revealed. What? Also, what's the age category for this thing? People are either going to like this novel or they're just going to like think, nah, that's just too much writing, I'm not going to bother reading it. Also, will it have illustrations? Or, um, you know. Is this just going to like raise more questions and does this tie into the movie what? And the most important question of all, does this mean we will have several novels for the franchise? Including probably a side spin-off novel or short stories for FNAF World. I won't be surprised. But it expands the mythos. Yay! How about you expand the answers that everybody's looking for? You know, like some of the unanswered questions, you know, kind of like the little plot holes that are still there that need answering. No, they're kind of still there. So yes, it expands, it reveals a human element, meaning we're going to see the purple guy. We're probably going to find his goddamn name and everything and much more, possibly. I don't know. Maybe we'll even find out see the owner and the owner talking we get to see how the place went from what it was originally to closing and reopening again and we'll see like all the stuff and all the events that led up to it though some people have asked like interesting questions is it just going to be like x and eight state and this happened blah 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 and then move on or is it actually going to gradually bring you a story where you can follow along with it or are we just going to be like 10 years later blah 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 happened so, yes, it is going to be hardback, meaning we are going to pay for the book. And it will, of course, be for Kindle. And yes, we will be doing a reading of it. No clue, like, if we're going to get done for copywriting if we read the book, but we shouldn't because, I mean, I read mangas. So, yes, it'll be an interesting read. I guarantee I will get confused at some point. So I get confused easily. So how many guys are excited for the news of the FNAF novel? And what do you think the mythos might be? Unless it's going to be Booper. 
the introduction of Boopa. Boopa is finally explained. He turns out he was a little toy with a little wind up key on him and that's where Boopa came from. He was in the child's room the whole entire time. He was in charge of the Fredlings. Oh gosh, he might be king of the Fredlings. Scary thought. Anyway, that's the latest news for the FNAF novel with over 16 pages of comments asking about the novel. So yeah. I still want to know who the professional writer is. If they've done previous work before, um, depending like on what they've done, their journey, like if they're used to writing horror stories, that would be like their, what their best start and everything. So we don't know what it's going to be like. And we don't know like the age category for it. If it'd be for like mature, mature audiences, if it's going to be for younger ones, if it's going to come in multiple languages for around the world, because Scott has yet to say if it's going to be in different languages for everyone. <sighs> anyway, that's all for the FNAF novel. I don't know like how excited everybody is for that, along with the fact we are still waiting on more news for FNAF World, but don't worry, we've got more teasers to look at, or more like screenshots. Anyway, see you guys in the next video.